hey what is up guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're doing well during this coronavirus pandemic well today we're gonna look at the powder cake the new boy and arrow in fortnite save the world is it good well let's find out So the powder keg. Okay, so first of all, how to obtain it? Well, it is in the event items due on the llama shop, the newly renamed llama shop. Yeah, it's on the event items. You can buy it for gold, 1680 gold. So it's not that expensive. Um, so is it worth it? Well, that's what we are here to find out, aren't we? Well, what's the specialty of this? Because we have had a lot of bows and arrows in save the world for the past couple of weeks yeah i mean not weeks but months yeah um so what's the speciality well this belongs to the flintlock series of weapons so you can see here it's a flintlock series and of course being a bow and arrow it is under the sniper rifle category uh the specialty of this is after you struck a bow after two seconds after you stuck a bow Unless it hit a target, it has a, an explosion, which is the party piece of this weapon right now. Um, if you struck an enemy directly, it explodes on impact. But if you are if you struck an area uh, where the enemies are, the husks are, after two seconds, it's gonna do a big explosion and. Uh, it's juicy it is juicy anyways um all right so the uh, hero load I'm, I'm gonna use for this is i'm gonna use red Ryan ramirez uh, she's gonna increase the sniper damage by 17 percent and increase the fire rate by 45 uh, and i'm gonna use sure shot um rapid really jonesy i believe uh, it's gonna increase the critical damage by 75 percent I'm also going to use Cupid's arrow, which you don't really need it for this. You can either use this or maybe you can use uh, Zenith if you have. Uh, I mean, during critical hit, actually, I might switch it to Zenith. Um, survival list, uh, since I'm using Blast Mother Pass. Souring Might and Souring Hide. Actually, this you can either use Souring uh, Close or Souring Focus, depending on what you need. Uh, gadgets doesn't really matter uh okay uh before that uh, we'll see what are the perks that i have used for this so i have uh, yeah uh reload speed critical rating critical rating and damage damage because i would actually usually what i would do is i would go for maybe crit damage on this one um yeah i would actually like to go for a single crit rating and two crit damage but uh the damage the initial damage on this weapon is very very low it's very very low uh compared to something like the boom bar we'll, i will do the comparison later um so let's go into a match and find out what's what uh for this because the damage is very low i don't want to go to a very high mission plus i'm alone i'm so i'm not getting the damage buff that i'm getting from a party so i'm just gonna stick to a power level 100 mission for this um yeah let's go in Alrighty, guys so we are in a power level 100 mission right now and for my luck just to be i started spawning i can see uh, encampment there so yeah let's test it out Okay, it's not exploding on critical... Okay, it is not exploding on... I see, I see, I see, I see. 
it explodes on impact if it crits. My bad. Okay. So it explodes in, uh, in impact if it crits. If it doesn't crit, it does not explode. Interesting. Did it crit? No. And... Yeah, the range is pretty good. The range is pretty good with the explosion. Uh, but uh, we'll try to find another. I'm gonna put the ball here. Yeah, the range is pretty good. Target not yet located. All right, so there's a group of husks here. So I'm gonna try to do this. Yeah. I do love this range. I do love the range of the explosion is fantastic. Um, if you have sniper animations, I think this is gonna be my main weapon from here on. Um, if it crits, it explodes and it crit there. So yeah, it explodes on crit. It crit there. So that's how it works then, huh? In a pinch, you're gonna actually spam it like this and it'll take care of it. Uh, sniper ammo is not something that I use that much, so I'm, I don't mind using this weapon a lot. Um, yeah, it's actually kind of fun weapon to use right now. There's a group of husks there. There's an encampment here, but there's a group of husks there. I'm gonna go to the group there. Ooh. Okay. So it doesn't matter even the elevation of where the husks are, the explosion is going to take care of them anyways. Uh, because I hit my arrows right over here, uh, but the explosion took care of the husks that were here. So that's good I guess. Uh, the 50% crit rating in this actually helps out a lot. I didn't land it there. I didn't land it there. Uh, I'm gonna go to the encampment as well and try it out again. I love using this weapon. I really, really love using this weapon. This is my favorite boy and arrow in the game right now. Crit. Again, crit. Read. Ooh, I love that. So yes, is it worth it? Yeah, it is. This is a must-have bow and arrow in this game right now, and it's right now. It is my favorite. I actually prefer it to the boom bow because you can do more. Environmental damage, how can I put it? Um, this, yeah, so it can do more damage, it, the, even though the initial hit is kind of disappointing. I mean, if you are up against something like a 116 husk, it actually does really, really less damage. And this weapon is actually kind of useless against uh, smashers. I wish I can find one to show you guys, but um. Yeah, it is actually pretty damn useless against matches. So, yeah, guys, the verdict. Well, it is a good, it is a, it is one of the best bows bow and arrows in the game right now. Yes, the initial damage, you know, comparing it to the boom bow is actually low. Um, I mean, the boom bow I'm using right now, the the main one, it's blue roll it's not even uh, called roll it doesn't even have a damage perk and it does more damage on initial hit so if you're up against a smasher anything about power level 94 i wouldn't recommend using this um but if you're up against 
you know a group of husks uh, like we showed you then this weapon is actually much better even though i think you can actually kill them faster with the boom bow it's more fun to do it with the powder cake uh, that's what i believe it's actually more fun to do it with the powder cake than the boom bow um, these are my perks actually you can do it any way you want uh, but this is what works for me i like crit creating i like having crit hit chance actually that proved to be actually be best on this scene i actually thought uh, if it impacts at uh, on impact it does damage but it turns out that uh, it does the initial and uh, it uh, does the explosion initially if it crits so since i have a 50 percent crit chance you know that's not a big deal so yeah you should definitely buy this weapon it's it's fun to use it's make save the world you know not boring again anyhow thanks for watching guys i'll see you on the next one stay safe and catch you guys later